On Earth Day, I'm feeding my passion by birthing a new podcast, Companies That Care. My passion began 24 years ago when I managed a multi-state publications team at CH2M Hill, a global consulting firm. Our regional manager had a vision to embed sustainability into operations and transform our business. He asked our management team if we would pilot this initiative and we jumped to the task. We slashed our paper consumption, switched to recycled paper, bought durable kitchen goods, implemented low energy technology, and implemented recycling programs throughout the Northwest, Alaska, and Hawaii. Our pilot lit a flame, and a few years later, sustainability became a corporate initiative. We built an award-winning benchmark sustainability and corporate citizenship program that spanned the globe, and I had one of the best jobs. I got to tell the world about it. I was trained by the best and brightest in corporate social responsibility. So when I started my own company, I wrote my own CSR policy. Now I want to share the stories of companies that care and give back to their communities so we can spread the movement, like our sustainability pilot over 20 years ago. Companies That Care highlights leaders who use their business for good. We'll start with three episodes about sustainable fashion, food, and philanthropy. First, the Trace Collector from London, UK. Trace is a fashion brand and a nonprofit on a mission to make fashion regenerative. We needed to make sure that that product had a very tangible social and environmental positive impact. Second, Our Table Cooperative in Sherwood, Oregon is a cooperative model for community food systems. Our Table grows organic products and offers education and supports food security through their nonprofit. Well, how do we as individuals and maybe a collective of people uh, try and, and imagine something better? So we kind of came up with this vision for a more resilient and interdependent local food culture. Third, I interviewed two of my mentors. Elisa Speranza chaired the CH2M Foundation and Ellen Sandberg was the executive director. We spoke about how CH2M rebooted its foundation and invested in sustainable development around the world. Where companies spend their money has an impact, especially in social justice issues, um, more so today than ever. Whether it was education, science, technology, engineering, math education for women or for traditionally underrepresented individuals, whether it was literally building a bridge or water technology, you know, aligned so well with that brand purpose. Please join me on Earth Day for Companies That Care on April 22nd. Let's work together to make the world a better place for all.